Hello and welcome to the British Columbia Real Estate Association's Housing Market Update for May 2020. Sales across all provincial housing markets fell 50.8% year over year in April to a record low for the month of April of 3,284 units, reflecting strict adherence to social distancing guidelines on the part of households and the real estate industry. However, the industry, along with buyers and sellers, are innovating and adapting to the new normal. And as that continues, market activity should start to recover. The pandemic also dramatically slowed listings activity, prompting a 23% year-over-year decline in MLS residential active listings. The total supply of active listings is now down by more than 9,000 units compared to this time last year. Market conditions had been tightening prior to the pandemic, and so even with a sharp drop in sales, the province-wide sales to active listings ratio remained in balanced market territory at 11%. However, in these unusual times, the normal metrics used to gauge market conditions may not be as useful a guide. So contact your local realtor to identify market conditions in your area. Home prices were resilient in April, with most markets either flat or higher on a year-over-year -year basis. The MLS average price for BC was up 7.8% compared to this time last year, at $738,000. The MLS Home Price Composite Index, which measures the price of a typical home, increased 2.5% on a year-over-year -year basis in Greater Vancouver, and was up 1.9% in the Fraser Valley Board area, 4.5% in Victoria, 3.1% in the Vancouver Island Board area, and 1.7% in the Okanagan Mainline Board area. Now let's take a look at market conditions around the province. That's it for this month's housing market update. We hope everyone is safe and healthy, and we'll see you again next month.